Hello, this is Hood Holmes. I just want to do a quick video on Aliens Colonial Marines, the Collector's Edition. Uh, the game's coming out on February 12, 2013. I'm really excited about this game. Uh, we've been waiting for it quite a long time. Um, we got to play this actually at Eurogamer. Uh, we got to play the multiplayer, which was phenomenal. It was really good. I'm, I was looking forward to the single player quite a lot, but the multiplayer as well is excellent. Um, we queued up for about an hour and a half to try and play this game, um, but it was definitely worth the wait. We got about 10 minutes on it and it was really good fun. I could imagine playing this game for ages, working as a team. There's nothing more thrilling than seeing a little dot on your radar and there's an alien either below you or above you, you just don't know where they are. And that made it really exciting and tense for me as well, so I've, I really enjoyed that. Right, but let's talk about what comes inside. So first off, we've got the game. Um, I believe this is just standard edition, standard case. There's no still book with this, so it's not, well, it's not been announced yet anyway. So it should just be standard. We have the USCM dossier, including mission brief, USS Sephora schematic, the recruitment card, LV426 recon photo, USCM iron on badges, and USCM graduation certificate. Right, we got the best thing about this collector edition, which is the power loader. Now, um, supposedly this is supposed to be a high quality resin as well, so it's going to be a really good figure. I can't wait to get this out of the box and have a look at this. Although if you've seen any of my collector's videos, I tend not to get things out of the boxes too long. And I keep to seem to put them away and hide them away for future value. <laughs> and all of this gorgeous stuff is going to come in the limited edition Xenohive box. Um, this is going to look amazing in my cabinet. That box, that box just looks amazing. I can't wait to see that when it turns up on my doorstep. There's quite a lot of downloadable content with this one actually, um, so I'm going to start off with the first piece which is four playable movie characters, so that includes Private Hudson, Corporal Hicks, Private Drake and Sergeant Apone. We then have Ripley's Flamethrower, which I'm really looking forward to using, can't wait to see those aliens burst out and the acid sprays everywhere, it goes all over your face and your face melts off. There is additional marine customization, although I'm not sure what this actually is yet. I've tried looking around for this and I can't find any other information. If anyone knows, please comment on this and uh, let me know, because I'd love to know. There is an exclusive level, uh, which is the USCM Academy Firing Range level. And the last thing we have is the multiplayer exclusive weapons, which includes the Phase Plasma Rifle and Sonic Electronic Ball Breakers. I, for one, do not want my balls broken by the Sonic Electronic Ball Breakers. Right, well that's everything folks, I hope you've enjoyed this video, and I hope you're even more excited now than you were before. I for one am extremely excited, and I cannot wait until this the game comes out in February, but I'm going to have to wait. I'll be picking up stuff on the Xbox version rather than PC, as uh, I've got a lot of friends who've got Xboxes and are going to get this as well, so I'm not missing out on the multiplayer on this one. If anyone fancies a game on the Xbox, please send me a gamer tag and I'll add you to my friends list and we can have a game. We can blast some aliens, or we can rip colonial marines to shreds. Thank you for watching and uh, yeah, please, if you like this video, give me a like, leave me a nice comment and subscribe to my channel and I will be doing a lot more videos including the Dishonored Hints and Tips video shortly when this comes out this Friday which again, I can't wait for Dishonored. Please give me comments. If you've anyone else wants to talk about Dishonored, give me a shout. I'd, I'd love to discuss my experience with the game. Uh, I got 30 minutes of gameplay at Eurogamer uh, which was amazing. I got a lot done in that time. And I can tell you, it made me so excited for this game coming out. It made me even more excited than I was before. So yeah, thank you very much, and I'll see you soon.